Indonesia's President Joko Widodo has suspended the chief of the country's anti-graph agency, his aide said on Saturday, November 25, following an accusation of extortion in an investigation that has ensnared a former minister. The step came after police this week named the official, Feli Boyeri, as a suspect accused of extorting money from former Agriculture Minister Cyril Yassin Limpo, who was detained in a corruption case last month. President Joko Widodo has signed a presidential decree on the suspension of KPK Chief Feli Boyeri, said Ori Dwipayona, the coordinator of the president's special staff, using the abbreviation of the agency's name. Widodo's letter, signed on Friday, takes immediate effect, releasing Furley from all his tasks and authority until he is fully discharged once his status changes to defendant, he added. With Nawawi Pamelango, a deputy, named as interim successor. Furley and the agency did not immediately respond to a request for comment. A former inspector general of police, Furley becomes the latest official in Widodo's administration to face graph accusations. Police said authorities had confiscated foreign currency transaction documents from Singapore and 7.4 billion rupiah, 480,000 US dollars worth of US currency in two rates relating to the case against him. Furley was appointed in 2019 at around the time critics said the agency formerly known as the Corruption Eradication Commission, had been weakened by changes to the law governing it, triggering a series of protests that aimed to save the body. On Thursday, a former agency chief and a number of investigators shaved their heads in front of its office in the Indonesian capital of Jakarta, saying the gesture celebrated the clean-up.